if your Sony Bravia Google TV has become extremely slow, it's laggy or freezes, takes a long time to respond to the remote, the apps are slow to start or fails to load, then I'll show you the most effective and easy ways to speed up your Sony 4K Smart TV in just a few minutes. When you keep using your TV for a while, it becomes gradually slower and some software glitches may appear. And we can easily fix that by cold booting your TV. To do that, disconnect your TV from power and you'll need to wait about 5 minutes. Then turn your TV back on. Now your TV will get a proper refresh and it should noticeably speed up. If that wasn't enough and your TV still gets slower very fast, then you can disable the background app process so that none of the apps run in the background. To do that, you'll need to go to settings. Then go to System, About, scroll down and find Android TV OS Build. Press OK 7 times. And now you have unlocked Developer Options. So go back and find Developer Options, open it, then find Background Process Limit. Select it and you can select no background processes at all. This will make sure that no app is running in the background and your TV will speed up considerably. But if you want, you can also choose one process or two process and see if that works. Also from developer options, you can turn off the system animation, which can save a bit of memory. To do that, go up a few rows, then change all these animation scales to animation off. If it's hard to adjust, then you can keep it to 0.5, and this should make your TV feel a bit faster. Then you can go to power and energy and make sure power saving is turned off, so that your TV runs on top performance. And most of the times, if you use a different HDMI input, then you can go to power on behavior and select it as last use input, so that you can skip the loading process of Google TV home screen and get straight to the console or TV box that you use. Then we have storage. If your TV's internal storage is running low on space, then this will cause your TV to become extremely slow. So you can just go to apps and uninstall any app that you don't use. This will free up your TV's space and you'll notice your TV will act a lot faster. You can also go ahead and disable the built-in apps. Also. Those of you who are using an external USB storage to store your apps, then this can cause your TV to become slow as the external drives can heat up very quickly and cause all the apps that stored inside to malfunction. So just move all the apps back to your TV's internal storage and disconnect the drive. Then we can go to about and make sure that your system is up to date. Now that we have tackled everything in the system options, now your TV should work smoother. After following all these steps, if your TV is still slow, then to speed it up a bit more, you can get rid of all the suggestions that you see on Google TV's home screen and switch to app-only mode. To do that, from the home screen, go to the top left, select your account, then manage accounts, go to your profile, then to the bottom and turn on apps-only mode. Press turn on again. Now if you go back to home, you'll see a lot less suggested content and your Google TV will take a very short time to load and respond snappier than ever. And if you want to turn it off, then just go to the same place and toggle it off. Now hopefully this has made your Sony Google TV a lot faster. But if this wasn't enough and your TV is still causing trouble, then as a last resort you can hard reset your TV and set it up from the scratch. But note that this will erase all your data that's on your TV. And after the factory reset, your TV should run just like it was out of the box. And that's all for this video. If you found this helpful, make sure to give us a thumbs up, subscribe and I'll see you around.